not entirely sure what that was. Hi, my name's Tom and I want to raise awareness on an environmentally friendly, sustainable way of living. For decades now, humanity has been turning natural resources into equipment that the average person will use, like, once before they get rid of it. And this has been the norm for a while. This is a really inefficient way of living, and it leaves behind tons of waste to just fester. This would be fine if it didn't take so long to decompose. I think I can speak for a lot of people when I say that I think something should be done. So what can we do? This is where Earthships come in. Earthships, as defined by Earthship Biotexture, is a type of house built with natural and recycled materials like old tyres and plastic, with energy conservation in mind. They are designed to produce water, electricity and food for their own use. It's literal genius. Now, I can hear you typing away in the comments, but Tom, a house made entirely out of rubbish sounds really gross. And, well, yeah, I thought so too at first, but you'd be surprised how creative people can be with them. People are making masterpieces of architecture out of stuff that's all being completely recycled. Now, if you're in the same age group or generation as me, you probably feel quite guilty about the state of the planet, and at the same time you're going to need somewhere to live pretty soon. This is why Earthships are perfect. Just look at how much you can save from living in an Earthship. Earthship Biotexture, the leading company in building and designing Earthships, are based in New Mexico, and we hope to be able to give them more publicity and make people more aware of their cause. Because seriously, look how cool these Earthships are. Look at this one. Look at this one! Look at this bedroom which has been made entirely out of recycled equipment. Now you look me dead in the eye and tell me you do not want to have a fat sleep in that bed- Sorry about that, he gets easily distracted. Now I know what you may be thinking, but DJ, I don't live in New Mexico, or Jamaica, or Bolivia. And yeah, I get it. Well, you don't live in a lot of places. Well, just because you can't contribute to Earth Street Biotexture, doesn't mean you can't help at all. Simply, just reduce the amount of loose plastic waste you leave behind by packing plastic into plastic bottles known as eco-bricks. Eco-bricks are extremely dense and can be used as building materials. I know this sounds insane, but people build houses, roads, showers, you name it. You can build just about anything with them. And in all honesty, the stuff people have made out of them actually genuinely looks really cool. Tell me this house made out of eco-bricks doesn't look amazing. Here is an eco brick I stuffed earlier. So, here is how we made it. The eco brick, that being.
How are you going to help stop this? Plastic bottles take 450 years to decompose. That fact alone should help to motivate you about making a change. We've made a few jokes during this video, but in all seriousness, it is a necessity to recycle now more than ever. Mass production of plastic started six decades ago and has now accumulated to 8.3 billion metric tons, the majority being in disposable products. Of the 8.3 billion metric tons that has been produced, 6.3 billion metric tons has become plastic waste. Of that, only 9% has been recycled. The vast majority, 79%, is accumulating in landfills or sloughing off in the natural environment as litter. Meaning, at some point, much of it ends up in the oceans, the final sink. Only 12% has been incinerated. Tyres are the perfect form for a rammed earth brick. There's no shortage of used tyres. At least 2.5 billion are currently stockpiled in the United States, with 2.5 million more discarded every year. Tyres can be seen as a globally available natural resource. Earthships are structures that heat and cool themselves without electric heat, burning fossil fuels or wood. 30% of all energy that is produced in the world is used for heating and cooling buildings. To learn more, visit Earthship Biotecture. So, after you've finished watching the video and disapproved for the very sudden and abrupt ending, and you go home and put your feet up, think, what can you do to help? We're doing our part. Are you?